I'm Dr. John Kuhn from New Image Bariatric Surgical Associates, and you're watching the Weight Loss Surgery Channel. Welcome to Weight Loss Surgery News. I'm your host, Leslie Thompson, and thank you for joining us today. In this week's news, we'll look at new developments to improve gastric banding surgery. We'll also find out how being obese may prevent a group of college students from graduating. And we'll take a close look at a controversial weight loss pill. All of that coming up, but first, doctors in the United Kingdom are saying that many fad diets could be simply sustaining obesity rates. The British Society of Gastroenterology, or BSG, conducted a survey among doctors who deal with obese patients. As in the States, there's no shortage of diets these patients will try in hopes of a quick fix weight loss. But as with most fad diets throughout history, people who try them can't live on them for long. At best, they only get temporary results. At worst, they get health problems. BSG President Chris Hawkey said the fad diet trend will only keep obesity rates where they are since people either try diets that cause them to eat high amounts of fat or they quit diets that are too strict and then return to eating what made them obese in the first place. So what's the best way to lose weight short of bariatric surgery? Same as it ever was burning more energy than you take in by increasing physical activity and cutting back on calories. In other news, the Irish company Crossbond Limited recently received a grant of more than a million dollars to improve gastric banding techniques. Sources say the company will use this money to modify a device that already exists called EndoFlip, which is designed to measure the dimensions and functions of hollow organs in the gastrointestinal tract. The company is now working on a new Barrow Flip device that will allow a surgeon to accurately measure both the size of the pouch and the food passage that he creates for a patient during gastric banding surgery. Being able to take these measurements during the operation may eliminate the need for patients to return later to have a doctor adjust their band. Also, some gastric band patients fail to lose weight at an expected rate after they have surgery. If successful, the new Barrow Flip device will help doctors assess the size of the patient's food pouch better than ever before. It's time for a quick break. When we come back, we'll see what's happening with a group of college seniors who may not graduate because of their weight and fill you in on the latest developments surrounding a questionable weight loss drug. We'll be right back. The Weight Loss Surgery Channel is proud to partner with RenewedReflections.com for weight loss surgery support. Share encouragement, strength, and hope with new friends online. And get the skinny on different weight loss surgery procedures from a resource you can trust. All at RenewedReflections.com. 